Kumusta yon lahat? Ako si Eduardo. Well, that was an introduction in Tagalog. Yes, my friends. This is a language that I've been studying for maybe five months already, but I haven't been that, uh, maybe that constant or perseverant. Uh, I have to let you know that I, the first time I had the, the feeling, the desire to study Tagalog was back in 2009. At that time I was working at a call center and there I met a Filipina girl um, so we made friends. Somehow she was close to me and then I asked her if she could teach me Tagalog but then you know guys I found the language so difficult so daunting that I just gave up sadly. Well I remember that I you know I used to stutter and couldn't you know pronounce the words. I remember that once I went to her house well, the apartment that she was renting and um, her aunt showed me um, actually showed me a Bible, a Catholic Bible in Tagalog well, that was really, you know, uh, guys, that was really challenging because I tried to read the, the passage of the Bible but, you know, I was just, was just crazy yeah, it was crazy so um, I actually would say that that didn't uh, actually um, well, help me to learn the language because you know that that kind of literature is really formal and somehow doesn't represent the way Filipinos speak the language, right? On a daily basis. So I would say that that was my, well, that was the first time that I had exposure to Tagalog then I spoke to my friend and told her that I wouldn't continue studying Tagalog because that was too difficult yeah so now it's 2018 and now I feel much better I feel more comfortable that I have the, the potential and knowledge to speak this language okay so um, Let's see, um, in the next video I like to, to say some phrases in Tagalog, some phrases that I've learned, and well, believe me, it, it is still difficult, because I would say that one of the most uh, challenging things of Tagalog are the verbs, the structure, you know, that there are direct pronouns, indirect pronouns. Uh, sometimes uh, verbs have two forms depending on the focus that you want to transmit on the sentence on your ideas so you know but it's, you know Pauls that's not so easy it, that, that takes time and I've seen people on the internet for instance you know I've seen people on the internet uh, trying to speak Tagalog and that's just wonderful uh, that's something that I like to do. I like to make uh, monologues. Well, you know, because I will be the only one speaking monologues, uh, practicing and speaking Tagalog, and I'll show the the subtitles, but in Tagalog. That's something that I like to do. Okay, that's for now. Bye. Paalam.